welcome guardians today i'm doing a review on the last word from year three so this is the layout i'm going in with i'm playing night stalker for some reason i'm going to change that light to my blade denture um so yeah the last word is a Supremacy. pretty unique weapon you know, and that's Bravo the team. least way to explain it um, it's a hand cannon with Here's fan fire, works. which basically Wait, makes the weapon the a full auto hand cannon, which is, well, if you ask me, it's the only one of its kind. So, there we go, now I'm moving ahead. No idea how I'm going to do with it in this game. I mean, it tells me that they're already, so watch for any It's a lot easier to use it hit fire wise because it's not as aggressive on the recoil. zoom in and on sides when they start getting to a ridiculous distance. Ah, oh, he got me. With the Queen's Choice from a distance. I didn't know freaking side arms could have that much distance on them. Mistake, we should have left. I thought he was going to come. I would like he uses that thing anyway. The problem with the last word is it is very short range, so I do recommend backing it up with this sniper on long range maps. Instead. If you're a very aggressive person, this weapon is probably a good choice for you. It's on your player style. Just sit there with retail on this and you get your But that's why you're not going to land our sights as little as you can. Nice zone, this is my space. So as you can see, you're very restricted at distance. You've got to hurt yourself as much as you can. Don't get them shots off. You need to treat this one before that. Right, so on. They never saw it. Their dignity is yours. that done uh, 
basically I'm doing these reviews as a bit of gameplay and then I'll do a bit of a review afterwards. I should kill him. Ah! Went in there when I should have been boys and girls. I will defend to this heavy ammo and I will take it. Along with my teammates. Heavy ammo available. Thank you very much. Left. Thank you, Shan. Um, always remember to get your special ammo. Right. Do we see any targets? Do we see any targets? <laughs> West. Crest seized. Steal this one. Leave a surprise for them there. Ah, just out of range. It's all about being sneaky. Suppose you can creep up on him and you can kill him. Their glory goes to you. Oh, sorry, pal. Ah, oh, damn. I got wiped out. Sacrifice myself though to get the freaking denial. Denied. <laughs> he thought he was no gonna shot down there, but back. he did not. See, yeah, this is an opportunity to bring out sniper when you see him all fighting like that. Dodgy little get. <laughs> Sorry, pal. <laughs> but, and again, the problem with this hand cannon is the ammo. You know, you've got to have gone with this freaking. What the hell? How did that not get him? Jason Duke. Super, and I've destroyed everyone. So that was a good game. 
don't normally get games where you get that many kills, but today we did. Last word, destroy. So, how did we do? We got 12 quests, 49 eyes, 12 kill credits. So, do I have to collect all my own kill credits? I got a 2.1 KD. I destroyed them, son of a guns. Um, and I truly did enjoy that game. Um, did I get any rewards? Did I pause? So, I'm going to back out now and just talk through why it's good in the situation you've just seen it in. Um, so, full auto helps, even though I'll be honest, I don't know, a lot of situations I didn't use the full auto. I am very trigger happy, I always tend to pull the trigger rather than fire it. So, as I said, it's perk is that it's fan fired, so it can be fired quickly and automatically. Uh, it can be fired from the hip very accurately. As high caliber rounds for a little bit of range, that's just personal preference. You can have perfect balance or single point sling. And then you've got the last word, which is increased stability, target acquisition when firing from the hip, which again explains why it's so much harder to aim the weapon rather than just hip fire it. So, again, unless they're at a very far distance and they're just oh, like a one bullet kill, don't bother aiming down your sights. Keep it to close distance and hit fire that thing like crazy. Um, again, this is my personal preference for using it, cause, just because that's what works. Um, people say that it's not as good as it was in year one. Probably isn't, but you've just seen me destroy with it in Supremacy. So, still useful, still good. Recommend for trials? Yes. What would I back it up with? I would personally back it up with a sniper or possibly a sidearm with range perks because that way you're always going to have secondary ammo uh, but it kind of means that you've got two hand cannons which is a bit weird so I personally go for the sniper so it give you that long range ability since that's going to be completely useless at that point. I hope you've enjoyed watching guys don't forget to leave a comment, like and subscribe.